Hey everyone, DJ McGones here and welcome back, where today I'm going to be telling you all about the brand new Piggy update which includes a brand new chapter, a brand new skin, and a brand new build mode player skin. Let's start with the chapter. This chapter is called Heist and doesn't have a number like chapter 11 because it's an extra character focused chapter, which means that it'll probably be unavailable to play when the next chapter comes out. It is set way back before the alleys and even before the infection started, it appears to be just after Daisy, the person that was looking after Willow and William, was drafted for military service, which means that Willow's younger brother William is pretty sad. In the opening cutscene, we see Willow and a group of friends including Billy, Pony, and Rash standing in one of the rooms in the alleys. Willow tells them that William is sad and won't talk to her. Billy suggests that they steal something for him. Then the chapter starts. In this chapter, you will either play as Pony or Willow, but they're not the normal Pony and Willow. They're the younger TSP versions of the characters, which means that they have masks over their eyes. This chapter is basically an edited version of alleys with some rooms added and some rooms taken out. To beat this chapter, you have to do a whole load of things, including getting the crowbar so Rash can smash a door, and jumping and crouching to get through a bunch of lasers, all while being chased by Polly. The interesting thing about Polly is that this is set before the infection, which means Polly isn't infected. The only reason he is chasing you is because you're breaking into a building and he's a police officer. When you do manage to get to the end, you'll find a pie. Why a pie is guarded by lasers, I don't know. Anyway, you then have to bring the pie to the main door at the start of the map, and the end cutscene will play. This cutscene is accompanied by the song Washed Clean in the River by B Slick and Matthew Curtis, which makes this cutscene pretty awesome. So I'm going to let you guys watch it first, and then I'll do a breakdown of it. I stood here once before, not long ago. Wish I could change the past, but we're past that. So I'm washed clean in the river, but my mind's not at ease. All these memories within my past have got me on my knees. ran free the dust that kicks up with my shoes resemble memories covering my clothes my face and staying with me day to day until I wash it all away try to rid myself of faith when wash clean in the river and crack with life-giving liquid memories so vivid and then we all can move on will the river flow like once before blowing by every bend every shore with life-giving liquid memories so vivid and then we all can move on will the river ever flow off back Every crevice and crack with life giving liquid memories so vivid. And then we all can move on. Will the river flow like once before? Flowing by every bend, every shore with life giving liquid memories so vivid. And then we all can be. Whoa. 
wash clean in the river, but my mind's not at ease. All these memories within my past have got me on my knees. Though I'm washed clean by the river, inside is my disease. As it eats away, leaves only pain. I hope you hear my plea. So this cutscene starts with Willow arriving to give William the pie, and then sees that he's gone. At the moment, we don't know exactly where he's gone, but he probably ran away. We then see Willow getting arrested by Doggy, which is what happened at the end of Alley's. Then it cuts to Willow in prison, and an infected Polly walks past, showing that the infection is now started. Willow looks at a key that's on the ground, hinting that she's going to try to escape. We then see Willow walking through the alleys, probably after escaping. She then finds her old friend Rash, who is now infected and locked up. The scene is pretty sad, just because it shows how much her old life has fallen apart since she's been in prison. We then see Willow burning down her old home in the alleys. Willow then finds Tigru, who appears to be homeless, and she seems to convince him to join TSP, aka the Silver Paw. We then see Pony sitting by a lake looking at a picture of him and Zizzy as kids. This reveals that he knew Zizzy way before the infection. Willow approaches him and asks him to join TSP as well. We then see Willow and the rest of TSP arriving at the hospital to get Substance 128, which is the potion that infects people. Willow then forces Pony to give Doggy the bottle containing Substance 128, therefore getting revenge on Doggy for arresting her. We then see Pony in TSP's base at the factory looking at the picture of Zizzy and him. This shows that he doesn't like what TSP are doing and he wants to try and find Zizzy. Then we see him standing in front of the safe place with Zizzy. We then see Willow sitting by a lake and hugging William's scarf. And finally, we see Willow standing in the camp and looking sadly at Daisy, who is now infected, revealing that that's what she was looking at at the end of Chapter 11 camp. As well as this chapter, there's a new skin. It's called Toby and it appears to be a firefighter turtle. There's also a new build mode skin, which is a thief version of Pony. That's all for this brand new update. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Subscribe, and I will see you all next time. Bye!